wassalatu wassalamu ala ashrafil anbiya wal mursalin nabiyyina muhammadin sallallahu alayhi wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa ba'd a yan wa masu girma assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh ana kara godiya ga Allah tabarak wa ta'ala mai girma da daukaka wadda ya yadda mu izo wannan lokaci mai albarka kamar yadda muka ambata ajiya cewa yau za mu tashi a inda kwana a wancan a tafsiri na wancan shekara wala cikin suratul mu'minun za mu tashi akan aya ta 101 aya ta 101 inda Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yake cewa fa idha nufikha fi suri fala ansaba bainahum أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم فإذا نفخ في الصور فلا أنساب بينهم يومئذ ولا يتساءلون تو وانا آية إذا آية تدريد الآية سورة المؤمنون kuma tana da alaka da ayoyin da suka bace ta wanda a ciki mun karancewa dan adam idan lokacin komayen shiga Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yayi to zai nemi a maida shi duniya ba dan komai ba sai dan yi aikata aiki na kwarai babu abin da dan adam zai bukata a lokacin daukar ransa kamar a kara mashi lokaci to Allah ta'ala ba zai kara wa kowa ba da kullu ummatin ajal fa idha jaa ajaluhum fala yastakhiruna sa'atan wala yastaqdimun shi sa dama ce babba ga duk wanda yake raye ya yi amfani da lokaci na yaka ta ayyuka na gari gari musamman lokuta masu tsada ir ramadan dogon ba kowa ne yake da wato ainihin garanti na cewa ma zai kare wannan watan ba bari har a maimaita mashi wasu watannin wanda za su taho na ramadan can gaba to idan mutun har ya kai ga Allah ta'ala yana cikin wato ainihin kabarin sa idan aka hura kaho Allah ta'ala yace fa idha nufikha fi suri idan aka hura a tu'ainin kaho fala an sa bainahum babu dangantaka wanda zai saura a tsakanin su wannan gaba na an sa a tu'ainin dangantaka yana da muhimmanci kwarai domin a duniya dangantaka yana aiki idan aka ce maka ga shugaban kasa ko ga gwamna ko ga wani chairman ko ga wani mai matsayi ko ga wani mai kudi ko ga wani mai yaya ko wani mai ilimi ko wani mai matsayi to wa'annan abubuwan suna amfani musamman a Najeriya wani idan ka dubi ma irin wato rigar da ya saka ko kuma irin wato manna manna da aka mashi na daukaka na sarauta ko soja ko dan sarda to kai ka san ba wanda za ka wa maganar cewa me yasa yake zani ba hatta bincike wannan wasu ba a bincikan su a kasar nan idan ana binciken jama'a ba su binciwa saboda dangantaka to shi yasa Allah ta'ala yace wa mutane su gane dangantaka za ta yanke a can ba cewa dan wani ne ba cewa dan wanci ce ba cewa dan shugaban kasa ne ba a cewa ma kai shugaban kasa ne shi karan kansa ta yanke a lokacin to kuma Allah ta'ala yana gaya mana wannan ne domin mu yi tanadi wa kawunan fala an sabo bainahum babu dangantaka a ranar da aka hura kaho tsakanin su shi sa Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yace yawma yafirul mar'u min akhi wa ummihi wa abi wa sahibatihi wa bani 
لكل امرئ منهم يوم اذا شعر يغل اذا ka dauko wa'annan awin ka dubi uba da da irin so da Allah ta'ala ya sanya a tsakanin su yafirul mar'u min akhihi dan uwa wanda aka haife su tare uba dai uwa daya irin abin da Allah ya hada na jini ne dangantaka zai yake wa ummihi wa abi haka nan uwa ita ma dangantakan ta zai yanke da duk wanda take da shi ko uba ko uwa ko da ko miji duk zai yanke duk zai yanke ga baki dai Allah ta ala bayanin shi babu shi hatta macen da take ciki da ciki wa ba kiyama da kanta za ta fadda abin da ke cikin ta je fadda shi tana ta kanta to shi sa kada mutum ya zaci wani dangantaka yana nan wanda za ta amfane shi shi sa dan wani malami ya ce maka wadansu za a za a kutar da su gobe kiyama ta tsuniya ne ta tsuniya na kariya babu wanda zai fadda kai gobe kiyama kai za ka fadda kanka shi sa Allah ta'ala ya bayanin cewa za a samu ceto wannan ceton ba dangantaka ne za ta ceto ka ba Allah ne zai umurni cewa wane ceci wane wane ya ceci wane amma idan ba haka ba aikin ka kadai zai fadda ka shi sa annabi muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam ya ga yayin sa fatima radiyallahu anha yace ki tambayin dukan abin da ake tambayin dan adam wanda nake da shi zan baki amma gobe kiyama kowannen mu bayani zai wa Allah ta'ala babu abin da zan iya yi maki sai abin da ke wa kanki shi yasa yake yawan bata abu ba wanda za su taimaka mata fiye da abin da mutane suke kallo a duniya kaman irin lokacin da aka kawo bayi ana raba wa mutane bai bata ba ana raba wa mutane bayi dan su taimaka masu aiki na gida bai bata ba da ta da ta bukaci a bata sai ce mata barin baki abin da yake wannan saboda gobe kiyama ki dauka ka ki samu matsayi babba idan za ki bacci ki ce subhanallah 33 alhamdulillah 33 allahu akbar 33 ko kuma 33 da cika da kalma tala ilaha illallah muhammadur rasulullah wannan ya fi a ce kina da mai taimaka maki aiki domin duk aikin da kika yi a hidiman gidanki a matsayinki na mace Uh, ana rubuta maki ladan wannan aiki dan uwa masu girma in an kura kaho fala an saba bainahum yawma izin a wannan yinin wala ya ta sa'aluna ko ma a wannan izin a wannan yinin babu tambaya lokacin kura kaho babu tambaya ina wane ina su wane babu shi kowa abin da zai dinga cewa nafsi nafsi kai kai na kawai na sani aka ce annabi muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam shi kadai ne allah zai ba mu iko ya dinga cewa ummati ummati al'umata al'umata amma hatta annabawa yan uwansa kowannen su idan ya tashi a lokacin cewa zai nafsi nafsi kai na kai na yaya za'i da niyyar shi yasa da annabi sai ba da labari shi wa za a tashi wannan ranin tsirara tsirara za a tashi sai aisha radiyallahu anha ta ce ya rasulullah ka ce za a tayi tsirara ina maganar maza da mata a hade a waje guda za a raba kowanne ne da nashi koya yace na rantse da wanda raina ke hannunsa wadda ke tsiraran ma bai san shi na tsirara balle ya kalli tsiraicin dan wansa kaga bala'in da musiban ta kai inda ta kai na cewa a ce kamar inda muke anan a ce ana tsirara amma mutum bai ma sani ba bare ma ya kalli al'auran wani to shi sa bisa wannan ne ake so mutun yayi tanadi yayi tattali yayi aiki saboda a wannan yinin ya zamanto yana cikin wa'adda Allah ta'ala zai kubutar Allah muna roƙon ka kai mana sauki a wannan yinin ta sanya mu cikin wa'adda za su tsallake zuwa cikin zuwa shiga aljanna na'am In the name of Allah the most gracious the most merciful Surah Al-Mu'minun verse 101
Allah the Most High is telling us, has given us the scene of the day of Qiyamah. What is going to happen? Allah the Most High will command an angel to blow into trumpet, trumpet. So when that is done, Allah the Most High says, فَإِذَا نُفِقَ فِي السُورِ When trumpet is blown, فَلَا أَنْسَابَ بَيْنَهُمْ يَوْمَ إِذِنْ There will be no relationship between them on that day. وَلَا يَتَسَاعَلُونَ Neither will they ask about one another. This will be the situation on the day of Qiyamah. In this world, relationships and connections are of benefit. That is why you will find out that a person will commit a crime. <coughs> he may be punished according to the law if he does not have anybody behind him to serve him. But if he has someone behind him, let's say a president or a governor or any other influential person, then his connection will be of benefit to him. He will be set free. However, on the day of Qiyamah, it is only your righteous deed that is going to be of benefit to you. If you are saved, then you are saved by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala through his mercies as a result of your righteous deed. On the day of Qiyamah, Allah told us in other verses that it is a day يَفِرُّ الْمَرْءُ مِنْ أَخِيهِ A person will be running away from his brother. He will also be running away from his mother, from his father, from his wife. Allah the Most High said that everybody on that day will have, will be uh, concerned with only himself. So if this is the case, a Muslim should be very careful and make sure that his relationship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is a cordial one and he does righteousness. Even personalities like children of messengers, consider Fatima, beloved daughter of the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wasallam. He was reported to have invited her and told her that, O oh, Fatima, ask me whatever you wish of wealth for me to give you. You should know that I can be of benefit to you before Allah on the day of Qiyamah. Meaning it is your righteous deed that will serve you. You will receive account in accordance with what you have done in your worldly life. Even messengers of Allah themselves, they will be concerned solely about themselves. It is only the messenger of Allah Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam who will be concerned about his ummah saying, Ummati, Ummati, O Allah, my followers, my followers, O Allah. To the extent that when the Prophet sallallahu was describing the scene of Qiyamah, that people are going to be resurrected barefooted, they will be resurrected naked. Then Aisha radiallahu anha asked the Prophet sallallahu how is the situation going to be? Men and women brought at a place together naked. The Prophet sallallahu said that, oh Aisha, the situation is so catastrophic that one will be unmindful of the nakedness of any other person. So it is only his, himself that he is concerned with. We ask Allah the Most High in his infinite mercy to make the day of Qiyamah a very good day for us and may he save us on that day. فَمَنْ ثَقُلَتْ مَوَازِينُهُ فَأُولَٰئِكَ هُمُ الْمُفْلِحُونَ Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala ichi awanna ngini Wada dhasura bauta kadai Suni wada watu aini 
scaling su na aikin kwarewa nauyi wannan aya da ira iran ta a cikin alqur'ani su suke tabbatar da cewa za a yi awun aiki gobe kiyama za a auna ayyukan mu a gobe kiyama a Allah ta'ala ya ce faman thaqulat mawazinuhu duk wanda scaling sa yayi nauyi yayi nauyi da aikin alkhairi ya zanto ya kawo dukkan abin da ake bukata musamman abin da ya shafa rukunan nan guda biyar yayi shaida cewa babu abin bauta da gaskiya sai Allah sa'an nan annabi Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam banzan sa ne sa'an nan ya tsaye da salla wayannan salloli da aka ce mu yi sa'an nan ya ba da zakka idan yana da hali sa'an nan yayi wannan azumin da muke yi kamar yadda aka ce a yi sa'an nan kuma yayi aikin haji idan yana da iko kamar yadda Allah tabarak wa ta'ala bai farlanta shi akan wadda ba yi da hali ba ya bibiya da ayyuka na kwarai abin da ya shafi zikiri ya shafi istighfari ya shafi salati ga annabi Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam karatun alqur'ani kyauta ta ma'iyaye da yan uwa da makwabta da neman halaliya da gujema abin da bai shafe ka ba ayyuka na kwarai na gari na gari mutun ya dinga aikatawa ya zanto skelin sa yayi nauyi a wannan yinin Allah ta'ala ce fa ulaika humul muflihuna wa ancanin ka masu wannan daraja su suka rabauta almuflih mai rabo a qur'ani a shari'an musulunci ba shine wanda ya tara ya'ya ba ko da ya tara mata ko da ya tara ilimi ko da ya tara dukiya ko da hau sarautar mulki ko wani irin mulki ba shine mai rabo ba shi yasa a mizanin girmamawa a najeriya musamman musulman najeriya mizani ne wanda yake bukatan adada kallon sa da kyau idan wa'adda ba musulmi ba ya zanto mizanin su na daukaka da rabauta shine kudi da matsayi to babu shakka an kuskure wa mizani da Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yake san rabauta mizanin wato rabauta shine ayyuka na kwarai a lokacin sahabbai na rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam ba damuwa bane dan kana dukiya ba kuma damuwa ne ba dan baka da shi amma yanzu a wannan zamanin musamman a kasar mu abin da ake ce ba daukaka shine kamallaka ko ta hanyar haram ko ta hanyar halal ko ta koyaye nema misali shi yasa ya zamanto wato wato miza na abin da ake cewa kyau ya daga daga ayyukan kwarai ya koma samun duniya wannan shi yasa ake ta rige wannan shi yasa ake ta wato ainin hayaniya akan sai an tara duniya da a ce mizan mutumin kwarai shine ayyukan kwarai to da an rage wannan zarbabi da ake yi da shishigi da dole sai an samu duniya to shi Allah tabarak wa ta'ala mai kowa mai komai yace rabo a wajen sa masu nauyin skeli aiki na kwarai to shi yasa ya kamata mu dada canza mu kawo nan mu wato mai mai ake cewa wato daraja da daukaka yawan ibada wanda manzo san san ya karantar da yawan tsaiwa akai shine rabauta shine rabauta wannan shine wanda ba ba a yanzu rige akan sa da zaka samu mutun yayi rige wajen haddace alqur'ani wajen karanta alqur'ani wajen aiki da alqur'ani wajen kasancewar sa a masallaci ko da yaushe wannan ba shine wannan ba shi bane mai daraja yanzu a cikin mu hakikanin gaskiya kenan masu daraja shine wani irin mota ya hau wani irin gida ya mallaka wani irin office ya shiga sai zaman to masu tasowa su ma abinda suke barnan da za a yi nan gaba sai ya barnan da ake a yanzu sai dai idan an canza wato kwakwallan mutane 
da fahimtan su da kawo su ga addini wannan shi kadai ke iya tsallakar da mutane daga bala'in da za a samu nan gaba ai wanda ake ciccafkowa barayi ai ba dan kowa bane illa al'uma tarin jahar da cewa wannan abun shine shi shine miza shine daukaka shi sa barayi suka yi wa a sannan shi sa ake takakkamowa ana ta tsallakewa ana ta tarowa kaga kaga an fadi abu a ce ko musulmi shi ya mallake wannan ta hanya wadda bai da ce ba saboda al'uma da sirrin jahar da cewa ita ce daukaka ita ce daraja sai lokacin da aka aka koma dan da wannan fahimtar aka koma fahimta na cewa mutun ya zamanto kamili mutun ya zamanto tsayayye akan addini shine wato daraja a lokacin ne za a rage barnan da ake mizani na ayyukan kwarai su za su yi amfani goba kiyama Allah ta'ala ya sanya mu cikin masu ayyuka na gargari na faman thaqulat mawazinuhu Allah the most high says those whose skills of righteous deed were heavy fa ulaika humul muflihun those are the successful ones if you want to know who is going to be successful who is going to enter paradise as allah the most high has confirmed there are those who spend their lives in this world worshiping allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and doing righteous deed starting with the implementation and carrying out the five daily, the five pillars of islam uh, prayers fasting hajj zakat in addition to declaration of the oneness of allah worshiping allah subhanahu wa ta'ala without associating any partner unto him other righteous deed of goodness to one's parents goodness to the muslims and even non muslims even animals goodness to neighbors and so many others also count heavy in one's scale on the day of qiyamah however unfortunately today what people consider as a criterion for honoring for respecting and for dignifying an individual is how much he controls if one is a millionaire or billionaire then that person earns people respect regardless of how he accumulates that his wealth whether it is through armed robbery whether it is through embezzlement as we are witnessing today in Nigeria where people are being prosecuted as a result of what they mismanage of public fund don't talk of million some even running up to billions unfortunately one is answering the name of a muslim dangers and problems will continue to befall this country until this mentality is changed until there is total reorientation what should earn a person regard to people should be righteousness however if it is wealth if it is one's position regardless of the way and manner he happens to emerge or to to emerge as a leader or to accumulate whatever he has accumulated if that should be our criterion for regarding people for respecting them then there will be much more problems ahead we ask allah the most high to save us and to make this country a better place for nigerian and for whoever want to come to live or to transact any business in the country اهدني فيه ونور لياليه و
ومن خفت موازينه فأولئك الذين خسروا أنفسهم في جهنم خالدون. تو دامن القرآني بس بلاغن سا. إذا نبتي شوا الخيري قاسك مكون سا. تشيما شري قاسك مكون سا. وما يعمل مثقال ذرة خير يرى. وما يعمل مثقال ذرة شر يرى. وانا شيني دي دي دا وانا عاوين قدا بيو. سوى ادى سكا اكتا نقراي سورة بوجا. سوى ني سكا حي. با ود دي تار دوكيا تكو تكو يا ايبا. الله تعالى شيو من خفت موازينو. دو ود سكي لنسا. نا ايكي نقراي. Yai sauki yerish nawi Yadhan chobabu kome achiki Tu wanna yashi gaboni Wanna yena chikin abinda aki chiwa hasara Allah ta'ala da kansi amba cha hasara achi Fa ulaika alladhina khasiru amfusahu Wa enda nsune wa enda sike hasara nkau na nsu Kasa yidan kai kasu wanchi Sayyida sayra wa abanda aki suriba Yidan kasa wanna nkasu wanchi nkaishi badha kai riba ba Tuda mbala kai shiba Bawe asara nkanka kai ba Asara nduki ya kai Kuma dumi hanka liyasani Chewa asara nduki ya Shi yepu sawki akan kai asara nkanka Domengi damba kai asara nkanka ba Adunia kana atanka asua Duki enda kana sayana iya dawa Enawa ni akai guwara aka asua Duki ensu yekwone kormos Daga bayo kuma alat alamos budi Amada achi susuro kuni achi kwa namuta akaga angama sidi achang. Tu danga dem bayi sanye hasara nduki ya. Bare achi yeye hasara rai. Bare achi yeye hasara ransa. Tu hasara ndoa ena muta ni dasi. Masikaran ching aichi mkuari. Ba hasara chete nduki ya ba a. Hasara chete kaunans. Susu kaya hasara nkaunansu Alat alache Ulaika alladhina khasiru Anfusahu Kaga angama kina Shisa adu abinda sika malaka adunia Bazi ampani suma Dada ache Sipansang kaunansu da abinda sika malaka adunia Bazi ampani suma Dada ache mutin yaman laki Nigeria Gaba kideba makutin Nigeria Adudug Nigeria ambash ajiunsa Idanya kuma ga Allah Ba charada nawiyan sikeni na kwaraiba Tu wana dunia, wana uduki ya madhata ambanishwa. Kehasa li, dik abinda mutinye malaka. Aloka chenda aka zari ransa. Ampanuwa na abu nyakari. Aida mutinye na dadabara. Beikamata ba. Bayanya haye shikara setim. Asamu yena warwaso nduki enda ba nasa ba. Duki enda ba nasa. Yaka mata achi ya hakura ya pasika nchila hira. Ama seka samu ya wanchi parana Manyani wanda seka malaki Abanda seka malaka ishashi Ama seka ji trilion Babiyamba Sana pachi wata kanu wane Da wane naduki ya njamaa Musiba deke Kan saata mkudu njamaa Iyaku musiba nkatari Kan adam wate ka saache duki ya nsa Sabo da idanka kwa shukudi ngana na jayira Gwabak ya ma kowa seka biyashi Kowa Seka hatada bobin na jayira Seka biyashi Aka samu wa nansu miya gumma la bayi Sana chewa asatu Aji ay umara ay addoa acha Ay du wan haki wa da ba na Allah ba Du umara nda kai Du azman nda kai ba de wa inkeshi ba Ko wa da ba muslimi Baka chuta Da suna nda ka jayi wa ta umara ko wa ta addoa Bayi wabu baki yama seka basha kinsa Aishi nsa akache Wanda nkaya nda kakao na alkhairi Wasu zas jeda zaka Zas jeda azmi Zas jeda zikiri Zas jeda istikfari Duk zas tafiri shikara tu Qur'ani Se Allah ta'ala che adenge kwashi wanda nkaya Ana raba mwanda akazalinta Ana kwashi wa Ana kwashi wa Dasa kilu ne Se kuma khafifu Idan aka kwashi kaya nkap Babu abundi saura Si Allah Ta'ala chiyo kudebozu ni bangwa enchang kulabta musu Ayo mweka mata mpukua wae wa Akin tawka nhaki nwane tang adam muslimi Mune weka mata nga kacheza achaja mutani Nga kacha ansa kwa watansu mazusuna EFCC 
a ce duk babu wani wanda yake da sunan musulmi a ciki wanda za a kama babu shi don me zaka je ka ka dai dukan jama'a kai da aka baka garanti din arziki cewa arzikin ka zai zo maka wa fi sama'i rizqukum wa ma tu'aduna duk inda arzikin ka yake sai ya taho duk makiyin ka ba zai iya tar arzikin ka ba kai da kake da wannan yaushe za a samu kana sata Allah ta'ala ce duk wanda aka rasa shi da nauyin sikeli na aikin kwarai ya zanto ayyukan kwarai din su suka yi kasa fa ulaika alladhina khasiru wayannan sun yi hasaran anfusahum fi jahannama za su kasance cikin jahannama khalidun madawama al khulud al khulud shine mutun ya dawoma babu ranan fita shine khulud ba fita shekara na kai a duniya da zaka daukan makanka wannan balai duka duka bai fi shekara 100 ba da ka kai shekara 100 sai a dinga tallata ka ana barin garuruwa a zuwa kalle ka ki mutuwa ka zama matsala ga jama'a abincin ka bai bai yuwa daidai wannan wannan sha'awar da kake da shi da dan adam ya kauce zakin abincin ma babu shi takawar ma ya gagara maganar ma bai yuwa jin ma ya daina kwalban idan ma da aka kara maka wani kwalba kwalban ma dubba zai aiki ba to ku to mai amfanin ka kai rayuwa a banza shekara 100 ne kawai idan idan ka kai to fi sabilillahi idan kana da lissafi yaushe za ka hada shekaru biliyan biliyan babu iyaka da shekara 100 inda a ce kai mai son mulki ne a ce an baka mulkin duniya ma ba najeriya ba kai shekara 100 kana mulkin baja ba ka baka ba bane ba sai an shekara 4 a ce ana ana zuwa ana zabe ana jujuya al'amura ba a an baka 100 kai kuma duniya aka baka kuma ta kare to me me saura idan kudi ne an tara maka kudin najeriya kam an baka me saura ba an shekara 100 to shi sa musulmi me 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 da bara shi shekaran ta qur'ani ya san gaskiyar al'amura domin a ciki za ga gaskiyar al'amura ba al'amuran mutane ba wanda za su danga soka ka cikin bala'i wani yayi kai ma sai kai wanci tayi ita ma sai tayi su wani sun yi kai ma sai kai sai su kai ka su baro ka kowa ya dubi skelin sa na aikin kwarai kowa ya dubi skelin sa na aikin kwarai domin wannan shine rabauta Allah muna roƙon ka ka sanya skelin mu na kwarai ya zaman to mai nauyi ko ba kiyama ka ba mu dama da iko na ayyuka na kwarai ka nisantar da mu daga barna wanda zai jawo skelin mai zaman to babu komai a cikin sa na'am wa man khaffat mawazinuhu on the other hand after mentioning the reward of those whose scales were heavy who are going to be in paradise then the opposite Woman khaffat mawazinuhu those whose skills were light fa ulaika alladhina khasiru anfusahum they are those who lost their souls fi jahannam khalidun they will be in the hell fire khalidun remaining and staying there for eternity uh, therefore this will be their own recompense in as much as one skills of righteous deed happens to be light is god heavy it is overweighed by the sins committed by that type of person then he has lost himself the benefit or the importance of business is to transact the business the capital remains and then it attracts profit however this type of business that these people transact they are alive in this world was not of benefit to them rather they lost themselves and they lost the capital and the profit if a businessman for example uh, got an accident of fire that engulfs and consume his shop or a total market allah the most high in his infinite mercy can make him richer than he was before so you can see this has happened so many times in a situation whereby the fire consumed the owner of the shop then how do you think of the capital what more of the uh, profit so uh, those whose scale of righteous deed is light 
then they have lost their lives, the capital and the profit, and their abode will be hellfire. A Muslim should be wise and should avoid and stay away from doing whatever will render him into hell fire, especially mismanaging and embezzling public funds. It is much easier for you or for a, a thief to rob or to attack an individual and take away his wealth. The accountability remains between you and that individual. But for one to mismanage the fund meant to uh, develop the country, that is Nigeria or any other country, then he is going to be charged to pay every citizen of that country, including the animals, because their lives will be made better if water is say, provided and other facilities that will make their lives more comfortable. So he is going to pay every citizen of this uh, country, no matter how many millions they are. And the danger is that one will present heavy rewards before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala on the day of Qiyamah. However, he will be declared as bankrupt. Why? So many people will be claiming he has uh, cheated me in this way. He has done this. Then Allah the Most High will be giving them your reward in pro proportionate to the vulm, the oppression you committed against them. Until the reward is exhausted and many people are there remaining still claiming from you what is going to be done when the reward is, uh, has been exhausted. Yes, Allah the Most High will say, okay, they have sins. So the sins they have committed will be taken in proportion to the zulm you committed against them until it remains no single amount of reward with that person, then he will be thrown into hellfire. This is whom is referred by the Prophet Sallallahu as Muflis, a bankrupt person. May Allah save you and I from being among those people. تلفح وجوههم النار وهم فيها كالحون. تو ويدا أيكن سنق وريء كرنشي. إيه سوق يذن تو بابو. قاسا كم يكون سوق بقية ما الله يسليم. تلفح وجوههم النار. فسكو كينسو سنابل بلال وطا. ميسا أكادو كوبسكا. دم دلوا كتير أكشي. An kona awam tu mpuska tu an kona shiga bada. Ena iyo kona ena iyo kona awani shashin jikinsa mpuska sabat sabat shutuba yezanjo wana nyanya sa musauki. Amani akiche mpuska mti nyanya kodi tu ya kodi kumus. Kina ya chizara kona shikote kwa in dini jikinsa kuno. Amasi akiche kwa mapi sada a jikinsa mpuska. Shisa Allah taala deke sambu mwan tu ba yinsa na gari. Seche wana mwaja mwapi saada ajikimu mudora shaa kasa Mwana masikankanda kai izu agarishi Mwana masikankanda kai izu agarishi Chisa gubaki yama Ida akatsaya gabang Allah akatsaya Saonshe kara dubu hamsin anasayi Dubu hamsin anasayi Baache ukua kwa mweba Tukua nansa yawa akache shine Azaba mutin Aibe ide dida ni imanda kasha Anajeria nishi kara aliba Shikara dubu hamsa Awa nansa ya wang Anabi Muhammad sallam Shikata ize iye neyman ama hii hisabi Bawai Bawai ake mutani aljanda ba Aa hii hisabi matuku Duwa na anabi ila akaji wajans Aka cheto Ya gaya ma Allah Gaya na inda ake chika hisabi Bade chi bade iya zwa ba Kakamu anabi adam bade iya ba Anabi nuhu bade iya ba Alayhi salatu wa salam Duka hara azokan su annabi Musa Su ni ulil azni manya manya anna ba Su annabi Musa, su annabi Isa, su annabi Ibrahim Annabi Ibrahim Khalilu Rahman Su subyune da manda shida annabi Muhammad Sallallahu sallam Illa wa niyati wana ashkin su Shima karanka sabada iya ba Say annabi Muhammad sallallahu sallam Yene miya yisu jada Yat ora goshin sa akasa Kama yidda muki yat ora wa Wadda shini mapi girman abinda dhaka wa Allah Na girma mawa Say Allah ta'ala yi chida shiya wa rana sajada bani ankari Wa edda sika yi arubuta Wa edda sika kikuma arubuta 
to shi yasa wannan fuskan yana da daraja sai Allah ta'ala ya ambaci kona shi domin kona shi kona sauran jiki ne talfa wujuha kumun nar wa hum fiha kalihuna su a cikin wannan mutan cikin azaba ne mai da dadi sai malamai suka ce to menene ma'anan kalihun ga dai fuska an ambata kuma an ce wutan jahannama ne malamai suka ce kalih shine a wannan yinin za a raba lebe da hakuri za su rabu labban mutum labban jama'a ga baki da wanda suke wutan jahannama saboda azaba leben sama zai hayo yazo sama leben kasa zai yi kasa har kwarai za su bayyana saboda azaba yanzu da za a ce a fudda leben mutum na sama da na kasa yi shigo masallacin nan wasu gudu za su yi saboda tsoron munin da zai dan jahannam muna ne daga fuskar sa wannan ba ana nufin fuskar ce kawai ake wa azaba ba a fuskar yanda za ta kasance wato kai ka san wannan ya fita daga yanayin kasance wannan dan adam shi sai Allah ta'ala ce la yamutu fiha wala yahya idan ka ga dan jahannama ba za ka zace yana raye ba saboda azaban da yake ciki bai ko mutu ba saboda akwai rai a tare da shi ai ka ga a rayuwar duniya idan mutum ana shakkan ko yana raye ko yana mutum haka dauko likita ya dauko kayan na'urar sa na gwaje gwaje idan ya gwaja zai dai gwada zai cewa ne kan shikenan kuma sai dai ai hakuri ya riga ya mutu to in likitan kwarai ne wanda ya san aikin su to ya mutu din idan ya gwada ya gwada yace da saura to shikenan da saura ana dai jiran lokaci to alahira in jahannama baka isa ka ce suna raye ba saboda bakar wahala da suke ciki da azaba ba kuma ka isa ka ce sun mutu ba domin da ran su suna jin azaban da ake musu hatta fatan jikunan jikin su banda lebe banda fuska Allah ta'ala ce kullu ma nadja juluduhum baddalnahum juludan ghairaha liyazukul azaba Allah ta'ala ce duk lokacin da fatan jikin su gaba daya ya kone ai ka san yanzu aka jefa mutum wuta na duniya in yi awa dai a cikin mutum ko ya kwana a cikin mutum to shikenan ya zama toka in dai wutan na ci ya mutu to na can ba maganar ya mutu duk lokacin da fatan jikin sa domin shi ke daukan zafin duk lokacin da ya kone sai Allah ta'ala ce ku yi mai sabon fata domin ba wajen mutuwa bane ba mutuwa shi sa Allah tabaarak wa ta'ala ce kun fiha kalihuna suna nan a cikin irin wannan azaba na lebun su yayi na sama ya kare yin sama na kasa ya sauko yayi muni amma duk da haka ana yi mishi azaba Allah ya tsare mu nan talfahu wujuhahum an-nar this will be their situation in the hell fire the fire will burn their faces Allah the most high refers to face here because it is the most important organ in one's body it is through face that you are identified it is through face that your handsomeness and otherwise is identified <coughs> or your righteousness can easily be identified through your face so this most important part of human body is going to be exposed to Allah's punishment on the day of qiyamah and fire will burn that part talfahu wujuhahum an-nar so because of the importance of this part of human body then Allah the most high makes it to be dedicated into worshiping him the most important aspect of salat is sujood how do you do sujood you do sujood by putting that most important part of your body on the ground in devotion to Allah the most high wa hum fiha kalihun and they that is the image of hellfire will be as ugly as anything in the hellfire because they are going to be kalihun their leaves will be despised with disfigured leaves if a human being will enter into the mosque in this mosque with his top uh, top lip cut away and the down one cut away and his teeth are exposed how do you imagine the ugliness of that person so 
This is an ordinary situation. While that of the hellfire, it is a special situation whereby they are made to look like that in order to look very, very ugly and also to know that they are under the anger and punishment of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Therefore, hellfire for you as a Muslim is not an abode. Therefore, try and see that you avoid whatever will lead you to the, uh, to the hellfire. ألم تكن آياتي تتلى عليكم فكنتم بها تكذبون. تو بعدين سنشكون نعيني أي أشيء موتن جهنم ما سأشيء دسو. ألم تكن آياتي تتلى عليكم شم بأكسن شيء أنا كرنت دكو آيه مبوا تو القرآن كنا. كذا تم بيا شيء تتوبيخ تأدت ولا كان تسو شم. Ba akaran tamu ku Alquran ibu ku, ba abah ku labarin syawal na abun de paru ku nazar tengkar iane. Kaga aishwad na be iman Alquran ibu aishibar wan sedah mangkoi chenli. Ama aceh mutingnya na muslimi, yedinge kabahirai, yedinge syirika, yedinge benda benda nandet bobi sabu de na suye zaman tu ye ye kau wan wan masai. Kaga ana bin nejaki de ransa, sabu de mutingnya na sang wan masai. Kerana macam anak harap bawa masa abu bawa awak dekik, kan agan ini syirik ani kerana semua dia nasun dunia. Kau malam ini sih kawan nang, wesu nang, suma malam ini suna su. Alat alat ini tambaya, desa atambaya su alam takun ayati tutla aleku. Ba akaran tamu ku alquran ibu adunia. Kaga ansa sih ni angkaran ta. The one day seorang awak, the one day ki hujat ayat ki akan sa. Dunia me karan ta alquran ini. Me dubam anang al Quran ibi kemat asam ish cikmon nanya naiba. Ungu akeh samu tu ayat sakti dengan kamu. Alam takun ayat itu telah aleku. Fakun tum biha tu kan dibun. Sebab kadang tu pun nak kari tu enang awing. Kaga dah wanda bah muslim wanita sih kena dah beri dengan orang ini. Mereka mahu kari tak kaga tersugi. Ama akeh samu wad di kesiga di gam muslim mai misali. Yeke dikang abin dah kene syirka. Yeke dikang abin dah kene kabahirai. Yeke jiji dah kaya misali. Dika abu wan dia sekat itu rasna ya Allah kamu tu. Tu Allah tu Allah itu kuat kerana tu kena kari tu enang ayam. Yang kau masuk irma, aku kari tu awan yang kebab dan kebab muti cuci cibet tu bang. Aku kari tu awan yang muti nyai dan amaya ki ayik. Tu dulu mumpah lagi. Sabo da abin da ake nipi da ayati anang Al-Qur'ani babu jaya Du wan wan da karanta tafsirin sa Zai che maka abin da Allah ta'ala Zai che agaya masu Shumba karanta maku awi naba Al-Qur'ani Tabari Allah ka'ara mushi rahma Parku wan de tar tar li tapun tafsiri Nama gabata Zai che abin da ake nipi Qur'ani Ibn Kathir Zai che Qur'ani Duk wan da kasamu sukur tumi Duk ta yisir dup sikachi Al-Qur'ani ni Tu yau, semuanya aikid al Quran ada di kamu aku mai, semuanya aikid al Quran ada di jamu aku mai, semuanya aikid al Quran aku kumu mimu, aji ho himu nama Muslimai, amat ainja goreng semuanya ini, kai kena aku lagi mabuk bang, tu yang matalah bakar maci bang, aku ada rasa kau rujuk al Quran wajang keran cawa. Aku dah rasa keran tahu rujuk Quran ini wajang ayat kata ayat kita Quran ini sen keran kita hasil lima sen hadis. Quran ini bahasa kita dah sihat dan kau yang Ramadan abu besi ba. Kau ayat cerawi dah sihat kau salam dari sihat. Ah Allah ayat kita dah sihat ini akaran kita si ayat ayat kita si adukkan penggalui nara yua. Amasalah si ayat ayat kita si agida je ayat ayat kita si. Aku cuma mu Aya aiki dish. Akaswa nungu de bonku na mu aya aiki dish. Alam tukum ayati tutla aleku. Batilawar kadeba. Aiki da al-Qur'ani. Chisa susa habbay azama nunsu. Ida ankaran tadasu aya goma na al-Qur'ani. Basa wuchiwa. Sesen karanta. Sesen pahimta. Wosumasen haddache. Saan nansu labba kasu si aiki dish. Be
اهدني فيه ونور لياليه الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين نبينا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وأصحابه وبعد أم وام سجرما السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته يوم ما كما يدم كسابا زام دورا ديري دم كوانا أجيا مولا تين سورة المؤمنون سورة المؤمنون زام تاش أكن آية تا Dalida cara, ah dalida cara. Inda Allah tabarak wa taala mengirimat oka kan? Iki cewa inna uka na farikum min ibadi ya kulu na Rabbana. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytanir rajim. Inna uka na farikum min ibadi ya kulu na Rabbana. فاغفر لنا فاغفر لنا وارحمنا وانت خير الراحمين. تو آه وانا آية إذا نجوا آه درس منجيا من أم بتشوا تو وتو وعد سكا كسن شيء أو تنجح نما كما أكيد مستنبيا. Sekarang nanti warna lek adara ne, kok mende watu aini su arbu tasu shek, watu shek iye ni tun tun tun. Sekarang ni me Allah ta Allah ni dah su dunia, do mung watu aini si aiki nak warai. Sekarang cik idam aku mai dah su idam basi aiki nak warai ba, tu lele su azal mai ni. Allah ta Allah cik su shuru, kat su kala magana. Tu yau. Allah Taala ina ambata mana watu jamaa dasiki kishio imwa inchang watu masu imani kina wa dasune gaza kusanchi aljana Allah Taala chi ina u lele ya kusanchi kana fariku mwen ibadi ya kusanchi wasu watu wasu shashi ni dagab chikimbai na inka gadama kachi wasu jamaa kuka chi wasu kunjui. Ko watu aini wasu muta ni wa edda suku ma alata ala ya basu martaban chi wa bayi nsa nisu min ibadi wana ndaraja chi wa ba alata baraka wa ta ala ya basu tu wa enna mbayi na ala sume siki chi wa alata ala ya chi ya kulu na sana chi wa rabbana ya ubangi jamu aman na mwenye imani abinda akiswa muslimi ya idama ya kasa nchi me imani Kuma ikasa nchimi hapa ka imani nsa Itabata kuli imani nsa ina kalua Kuma zundumansa sana alabua Ni santang abinda Allah ta'ala ya haram ta suna alabua Kusantang abinda Allah ta'ala ya umurnida ayakata sana kalua Yemishi imani yana kalua yana alabua Yana kalua ni Dawatu ayuka na gari gari Masikyaw Kama salla, kama zaka, kama aiki nghaji, istifari, zikiri, karatunga al-Qur'ani, kia utata wa jamaa, duwa enda nasa imana mutinya kalu. Yena ala uguwani, dama nyama nyanzi nabai, kama sata, kama zina, kama chacha, kama ruwatu aini mpashi, dika nkaba irahi kalia, yide wa nansu, wana nyena watu aini nakasa watu aini imani, yena aligishi. Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yake ya kunu na suna cewa rabbana ya ubangiji mu amana mu mun yi imani fakfil lana ka gafarta mana zunubanmu duk inda mutum yake da imani to za a same shi kuma yana aikata wani laifi ko babban laifi ko karmin laifi annabawa ne kadai Allah ta'ala ya wanke su ba sa lefuka to saboda haka mutum yake bukatan gafara fakfil lana ya ubangiji ka gafarta mana warhamna kai mana rahama Dua mumba buat dari syurga aljana, se Allah ya lulu besi darah masa. Siapa anak Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam itu sahabat sa, bab buat dari syurga aljana, cikin bayang Allah, se wad Allah taala lulu ber darah masa. So kacih hai kaya rasulullah, ye cihani 
ba zan shiga aljanna ba sai Allah ta'ala lul bin ramsa shi sa wa'annan bayin suna neman gafara suna neman rahman Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala sai suka ce a cikin addu'o'in su wa anta khairur rahimin lalle kai ne mafi alkhairin masu rahama ko da an samu wani yana da tausayi yana da jin kai to bai kai Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala ba Allah shi ya fi kowa jin kai Allah shi ya fi kowa tausayi Allah shi ya fi kowa rahama shi yasa daga cikin sunayen Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala arrahman arrahim shi arrahman rahama ce ta Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala akan dukkan halittu hatta wadda ba su yi Allah ba wadda ba musulmai ne ba hatta dabbobi duka sun shiga cikin wato ainihin rahama Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala arrahim malamai suka ce ita ma rahama ce amma ke babba Allah ba yi wa wadda bai cancanci wannan arrahim din ba shi sa a duniya saboda rahman Allah kowa yana yana iya yin kudi da musulmi da wadda ba musulmi ba da wadda zai yi sata da wadda ba zai yi sata ba da mu'mini da wadda ba mu'mini ba kull sai ga kowa Allah ya bashi saboda rahman Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala to amma rahimu sai wadda ya aikin ya cancanta shi za a bawa shi sa su anan a cikin addu'o'in su sai suka ce lalle kai ne mafi alkhairin masu rahama Allah muna roƙonka ka sanya mu cikin bayinka wadda za ka wa rahama na'am in the name of Allah the most gracious the most merciful yesterday Allah the most high told us about some of his servants who are going to be admitted into hell fire whereby they will stay there for eternity they will be praying asking Allah the most high to remove them from the hell fire promising that if they are brought back to the world and they still go back to the sin they had committed before then they are guilty of being wrong doers then because Allah the most high is annoyed with them Allah the most high will tell them ikhsa'u fiha remain there for eternity forever wala tukallimun do not speak to me again then on the other hand the believers Allah is telling us about them that innahu kana fariqun min ibadi indeed there was a party of my servant a group of my servants yaquluna rabbana amanna who were praying submissively praying to Allah the most high saying o oh Allah our lord amanna we have believed in you this is their quality believe in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala which is the most important thing a servant can present to Allah ta'ala and iman as scholars have said is something that increases and decreases it increases with increase in righteous deed such as self guard of prayers fasting observing those five daily prayers and other righteous deed of goodness to parents goodness to those who are in need and so many others so also it decreases through increase in uh, bad deeds committing of sin zina taking up alcohol backbiting and so on and so forth it is a clear indicator that if you find yourself committing such things since that you are iman the level of your iman is going down they used to say rabbana amanna o allah we believe in you faghfir lana therefore o allah forgive our shortcomings forgive our sins this is because no matter the level of one's iman in as much as he is not a messenger of allah then he is liable to committing sin disobeying allah the most high therefore he is required to be asking allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and presenting himself to allah as a sinner and be asking him to forgive him may allah forgive us warhamna they also used to say oh allah cover us with your mercy pardon our mistakes wa anta khairur rahimin because you are the best of the masfuls no matter how masful is an individual how sympathetic he is then the mercy of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala 
is far better. It cannot be compared with that of human being because that of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala encompasses everything. Allah the Most High among his attributes and his names is Ar-Rahman, the merciful, Ar-Rahim, and the, the beneficent, the merciful. The Rahmah of Allah the Most High is all encompassing. It covers everybody, the animals, the Muslims, the non-Muslims, and so on and so forth. Therefore, it is part of Rahmah of Allah. Someone can be extremely rich despite the fact that he disbelieves in Allah the Most High. Someone also can live comfortably, breathe in and out comfortably, can be healthy. All these are part of the Rahmah of Allah, which he gives to everybody, Muslims, non-Muslims, animals, and so on and so forth. However, his attribute and quality of being a Rahim is only specifically meant and prepared for those who are believers. Allah the Most High will never admit into his mercy except those who believe and do righteous deeds. May Allah make us among them. فَاتَّخَذْتُمُوهُمْ سِخْرِيًّا حَتَّى أَنْسَوْكُمْ ذِكْرِي وَكُنْتُمْ مِنْهُمْ تَضْحَكُونَ To shikye nambayang Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala ya bamu la baring wa enchang wa edda su suna chikim azabang Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala Say kumwe bamu la baring wa edda su imani yedda su masu tuwa masu neman rahmang Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala Da mang adunia anzawna tari Si Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yaitu Fattakastumu sukhiriya Si kukari kesu Abang izgili Wandangkana muslimi Shigangka bimbari yeshiba Si lukika abang izgili Lukika kai baka wae ba Baka machan chanchika zona Awanan dunia na buki chiba Sabu da kai Abu bonda aki na wae wa baka yi Baka shahe shahe Baka zina Baka chanza da biron ka wasu rubuce rubuce domin ka kwashi dukiya ba da gaskiya ba ba ka yin wa'annan sai a dinga ganin ka ba kauye ba kauye ba kuma cancanci rayuwa a wannan duniyar ba ko mace a ganta da hijabi ta tsare mutuncin ta wata can kuma ta daure gashin ta da na na doki ta dinga mata izgilin cewa wannan shigan na kauyawa ne to a duniya ana samun isti iza'i wato izgili gawaid da siki ganin ce wa ya kamata abu Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala sau da kafa to sai Allah ta'ala yake ba da wannan labari yace ashe bai kasance kun rike wato fattakasun kun rike wato ainin fastakasun kun rike su sahriyan kun rike su abun izgili hatta an saukum zikri wannan izgilin da ake wa masu imani har ya saka wa'ancan wanda suke izgilin sun mamance da su halitune na Allah ya kamata su ma su damu da waye halice su idan ma baka yadda da Allah misali ai ka san ba kai ka halice kanka ba ya kamata su shigaltu da tuna waye halice su ha su yi abin da ya gaya musu shi wanda halice shi da ma'ana ko da kai baka yadda da addinin musulunci ba sai ka shigaltu da abin da yake na addinin ka kamar yadda mu musulmai ba a yadda ka shigaltu da wani ba kai Bai mu ko a ganka masallaci kaje kai ta hayaniya da wani yau ka gan kana taimakawa ka gan kana ta fada da wani kai ba addinin fada kake ba shigaltuwa za ka yi da abin da ya kawo ka duniya idan wani shi bai shigaltu da abin da ya kawo shi ba to kai ba za ka yi irin abin da ya ba shi sa ba a yadda musulmi ya zagi wadda ba musulmi ba ko ya zagi abin bautan su Allah ya haramta haka domin in kai haka baka shigaltu da abin da ya kawo ka ولا تسبوا الذين كفروا فيسبوا الله عدوا بغير علم كذا 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 shi idan bai shigaltu ba kai ba dalili bane domin gashi ka ji Allah ta'ala anan yana wato ainihin gaya masa abin da suka yi wanda ya shigaltar da su daga ambatan Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala wa kuntum sai kuka kasance minhum daga gare su ta haƙuna kuna masu dariya za ka iya ganin wannan da yawa na kai in an ganka musulmi a wani waje ma 
dariya za a maka ko kai wani abu wanda ke musulunci ne yadda ko za a yi wani barna misali kace a ba daidai bane sai amma dariya na cewa kai baka ma waye ba ko an kwashi wadansu matan banza za a je a aikin banza kai kace ba za kai ba sai a dinga ma dariya na cewa kai baka waye ba za ka samu irin wannan dariyan da yawa ana yin sa shi yasa gobe kiyama su masu dariya ga wa'idda suke tsaye akan gaskiya to su ma za a musu dariya Allah tabarak wa ta'ala ce fal yawmal ladhina amanu min al kuffari yadhakun ala al ara'iki yanzurun hal thubu al kuffaru ma kanu yafalu wannan ayoyin suna nuna kamar yadda aka maka dariya ka kula da abin da ya dame ka dan ba rama wa aka ce kai ba wadda zai rama maka yana nan hasali ranar rama ko ma yana nan Allah ta'ala ce lokacin da su kuma masu imani za su rama dariyar su bil kufar ya haku lokacin suna kan wadansu wato ainin gadaje gadaje na nima ba gado irin na na duniya ba duk matsayin ka a duniya in aka ma gado na jin dadi gadan sai an lankwasa shi ko dai wani laburan ka ko wani kukun ka ya zo ya lankwasa shi ko kuma kai da kanka lankwasa gadan idan na kwanciya ne ka miƙe ku kwanta in na zama ne ka maida shi duk kai za ka yi ko amma amma shi na lahira wadda aka maka al'arai wadda aka maka wadda kake ki shingida kai yana da yana da alamomi wadda ya san ya san abin da ke zuciyanka idan kana son zama ne zai maka zai maka zai maka wato ainin yanayi da tanadi na zama ba sai ka lankwasa shi ba kana zaune in kana so ka shingida misali za ga wadansu yan sun jingina a jikin bango ko jikin wayannan ginshikan misali to idan jingina kake so kai to ya sani ya ji ba magana kai ba zai karkata daidai yadda kake bukatan sa idan kana so ka miƙe ne gaba daya zai karkatar da yadda zaka miƙe baki daya shi sa duk abin da aka ma aljanna yana sane da abin da kake bukata ruwa za ka shane yana sane in mai zafi ne kana sane in mai sanyi ne kana sane in ma yaye ne dai duk kana sane yana sane da abin da za ka kawo ba sai ka ce a kawo ma shayi ba shayin da kansa zai taho ba sai ka ce mai mai zafi sosai ba zai zafi da kansa ba sai ka ce mai sanyi sanyi ba zai sanyin da kansa to wani ma kake kake ciki a duniya har kake wani ganin zaka yi wa wani isti za a yi ko isgili babu shi hasali ko mai karewa ne wannan shi kuma wancin ba mai karewa ne shi sa duk wani wanda zai takalai ka kai to kar ka mai da mutane baka da bukatun kai haka baka da bukata don kai ba abin da ya kawo ka buke nan wannan shine maksudin maksudin wannan aya shi ta yi abin da shakaltar da shi kenan amma kai fa ba shi bane shi sa musulmi ya hattara da bata lokacin sa wajen jayayya wannan lokaci da wadda bai dace ba wajen fada da wadda bai dace ba wajen tsokana ya wannan lokaci da bai dace ba hasali ma zaka samu wani musulmi shi ke yin tsokana shi ke yin tsokana saboda yana ganin shi ke da karfi shi ke da yawa shi ke da abin nan sai ya tsokano abin da ba a sashi ba ba gwanin ta kai ba kuma ba imani bane domin istiza'i da izgili za a yi maka shi amma akwai ranan biya Allah tabarak wa ta'ala ya dora maka akan turban manzon Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam the servants of Allah described in verse 109 deserve honor and respect from everybody because the measurement and criterion for honoring an individual is his iman and they qualified as mu'minun however to the disbelievers fatakhatumuhum sikhriyan allah says that you took them in mockery instead of you to appreciate what they are doing the way they are worshiping allah their disposition their appearance the way they relate with people raza you take them in mockery you blackmail them you call them with names and tell them they are antisocial and as if they are people from another planet because why are they antisocial when people see smoking as uh, as social uh, as being social no they consider smoking as harmful and forbidden by allah therefore they don't smoke when others consider committing of fornication and adultery is a sign of being social 
they consider it as sin an act of disobedience to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that's, that's why they stay away from that all acts of sin they stay away from it therefore with these their disposition they are considered as people who are backward who do not know, did not know what they are doing uh, therefore what they deserve is not honor but what mockery فَتَخَذْتُمُوهُمْ سِخِرِيًّا حَتَّى أَنْسَوْكُمْ ذِكِرِي to the end to the extent that they made you to forget about my remembrance instead of them to face their uh, their own problem to understand who Allah is and worship him rather they have been taken away by mockery on those who believe to the extent that they forgot about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala they did not worship him to deserve entering paradise rather they disbelieve in him and they uh, ridicule his servants therefore they that made them to forget about the remembrance of Allah the Most High in addition to the mockery as if it is not enough and you used to laugh at them the way he appeared he should be laughed at why he did not release his trousers to the time that he to the extent that he's matching the trousers. If she is in hijab, then a black material, she looks like Satan. Satan is in dark, she's also in dark. Then she deserves to be loved, not to be respected, not to be honored. Then there will be a day, Allah the Most High says, Faliyam al Amanu Min al Kufari Yathakun. This day, that is the day of Qiyamah, is a day on which Alladina Amanu, those who believe, will be laughing at the disbelievers because they have been condemned inside hellfire while the, the believers are receiving their blessings in paradise. Therefore, you as a Muslim face your problem. Worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, regardless of who will appreciate you, regardless of who will condemn you, you know your target. But however, if you turn back, to face another person's uh, problem, then you will forget about the remembrance of Allah as these people did, and then in the end you will regret it. That is why Allah the Most High uh, forbid the Muslims from uh, abusing or condemning the objects of worship of those who disbelieve. Because if you do that, they will not abuse you, you as a person, rather they will even abuse Allah the Most High. Therefore you commit sin by abusing or by insulting object of worship of those who disbelieve. Uh, Allah tabarak wa ta'ala yaqubimu dakaramu itakala kusukana. Domin ba shine abin da ya kawo mu ba abin da ya kawo musulmi duniya ba ta ma Allah kashal bai da lokacin ya takali wani kuma kai shiriya bai hannunka yana hannun Allah tabarak wa ta'ala shi ke shiyar da wadda yaso shi ke batar da wadda yaso hasali inda musulmi yana da dogon hange ai wadda yake Allah bai dada Allah ba shi abun tausayi ne ba abun ai fada ne da shi ba abun fada bane ko da wasa abu ne na tausayi Abu ne wadda yake bukatan ka jawo shi fahimta abinda ka fahimta in bai fahimta ba wallahi alham ba ka da fada ko ka dan ba amma saka ba Allah ta'ala yace inni jazaitumul yawma lalle nayi musu sakayya a yau wa'ida suke imani bima sabaru saboda sun yi hakuri kaga abinda ake bukata wajen musulmi kenan hakuri idan mulki kake nema a duniya ka saka hakuri idan kudi kake nema ka sa hakuri aure kake nema ka sa hakuri wani abu kake nema ka saka hakuri in Allah ya nufi rabanka ne za ka same shi idan ba rabanka ne ba wannan hakurin da kai zai ba ka lada zai kuma ba ka kwanci hankali ba ta da hankali ba duk wannan yana ga ya musulmi cewa ya zanto ni tsatse ya fuskanci abun da ya kawo shi dan ta yi wannan abun da kake ta nema wadda ka kasa yin hakuri ya hana ka shagaltuwa da abin da ya kawo ka Ramadan 
dukkan nau'in aminci a barwa nagar ta da me saya da me sayarwa ai zamu ci tsadar da mujin masu iya magana ko suka ce dan juma ne da dan jummai ina masu sha'awar sayen dan fara dan farin gidaje na zamu ne na ajin karshe tsaka tsaki ko ko na kasa karbar hayar gida ofishi ko shago ko ko gina wake kake so mu kulama su sauta gudu ka zumburburki daidai na properties limited kamfanin da ya shirya dan samarwa kulawa da saukawa mutane mu halli akan farashi mai rahusa kadan daga cikin yana gidan da ke karshen kulawar na properties limited sun hada da na properties develop site dake Kado district babban birnin Tarayyar Najeriya Abuja sa'an nan new complex dake area Chen Abuja SHM complex Mabusha Abuja Iba Plaza gwaran fa dake garin Abuja new water complex Jabi Abuja sai concept plaza dake gwaran fa Abuja sa'an nan nawa industrial complex dake Idel Shima a babban birnin Tarayyar Najeriya Abuja sai residential apartment dake Jabi Abuja na Najeriya sai MKK Plaza dake gudu Abuja na Najeriya da dai sauran su taban garan Wuye mai tama districts na properties limited muna nan a adreshi mai lamba AP Shida Amak Plaza dake kallon Heritage House akan Jitin Sultan Abu Bakar dake Wuseizon 3 Abuja na Properties Limited ana iya samun mu akan adreshin mu na yanar gizo na wapro98@gmail.com ko alambar mu ta salula 0780888886 ana iya samun mu akan 0800525559599 ko ko akan 0800325569599 na Properties Limited farin cikin ku shine namu na Properties Limited na gargashin ma dubu hazi alhaji abdurrahman buhari mk chairman na properties limited